Hey, what's up traders? Today, we're going to dive into our new trade copier, now that it's been fully released and talk about all of its current features and a few we hope to add in the future. In our last two videos, we discussed how you can use the copier to manually trade from TradingView to NT8 and how you can locally copy trades on NT8 between any of your accounts. Let's start by recapping a little bit on those two similar but different approaches to give a full picture of everything you can do with our copier. First, if you want a non-Tradovate solution to manual trading from TradingView directly to NinjaTrader 8, then CrossTrade is your best and only real option. We use the existing Tradovate API connection on TradingView to target an account you can copy from. This is what we call a leader account. This leader account receives manual orders from TradingView, and then your followers on NT8 can copy all of those trades. Our copier offers two different execution modes. Order mode for ultra-precise synchronization where every limit order and bracket gets replicated exactly. And execution mode for speed where we focus on actual fills rather than pending orders. If you're manually trading from TV, we recommend using order mode so any pending order brackets also get copied. Setting aside the manual trading capabilities, let's now focus on everything you can do with the copier inside NT8. We specifically designed the copier to be flexible with a multi-directional system that allows any account to copy from any other account. This allows you to have certain accounts trade different symbols based on actions in other accounts and so on. You can truly create a complex network of events this way. As I mentioned before, there are two trading modes, order and execution. Order mode will copy all the pending orders and the execution, where execution mode will only copy the entry execution. There are pros and cons to both, and again, we specifically decided to offer both options to ensure you are free to create any kind of copy scenario you need. Next, we have Trade Inversion, which lets you automatically hedge positions by copying in reverse. You can go long in one account and immediately copy and invert that trade to go short in a different account. This comes in handy if you want to play a news event, trade the same strategy to compare forward testing, or simply bet against your own trades. Joking aside, let's keep going. Our position sizing offers 0.5 up to 10x copying. We have a built-in safeguard here to ensure that there's a minimum copy of one micro to avoid any edge case copies that could result in less than one contract being opened. Otherwise, you can scale your copying up and down and pair this with our symbol replacement to trade bigger or smaller size in certain accounts. There's also a max position side if you want to set a hard limit on the copies or leave it at zero for no restrictions at all. Next up, we have instrument filtering and symbol replacement. These two can work together to specify which symbols are allowed to be copied and also map out a leader to follower replacement scenario where, for example, the leader trades ES and the follower trades MES. As you can see, along with the position sizing flexibility, you can really control your sizing for each account. Some accounts can scale up, some can scale down, it's totally up to you. Now let's cover three features that make our copier better than everything else on the market. Stealth mode, auto sync, and tandem mode. Stealth mode makes our copied trades undetectable and look completely manual, which is appreciated by prop traders who want to stay under the radar at firms that try and flunk you for using a copier. Stealth mode works by mapping orders in the same way they would be done if manually trading and also navigates around any disconnects to reapply correctly. If you're planning to use a copier at a prop firm, this is the one you need. Now let's talk about auto sync. This is the ultimate safeguard if you want to ensure that your followers are always following the leader. Every three seconds, or more depending on your preference, your followers will check to see if they're representing the same positions as the leader account. If not, a resyncing will occur automatically. This ensures that there's no situation where the two become out of orbit from one another, which is a common problem with other NTA copiers. It's important to note that if you intend to take manual action on closing trades in a leader account, you'll want to remember to disengage syncing. Last but not least, during beta we added a tandem mode feature which works in tandem with your account manager. This is not a requirement of the copier, but it definitely increases the value of having the two working together. With tandem mode enabled, if your target or stop thresholds are hit, or the account goes flat, you will stop copying orders. If you ever dreamed of copying multiple accounts and having a unified kill switch after hitting your profit target, it's now a reality. Looking ahead, we have some other upgrades coming to the copier and other tools including group mode, more verbose logging, and an overhaul of our user pages to provide a full picture view of your copier relationships. The copier is now fully released and has already copied tens of thousands of trades from other CrossTrade members. If you want to give it a shot, head over to CrossTrade.io and sign up. Until next time, take care and trade well.